guys and welcome back to my channel so I asked you a couple of days ago on my YouTube channel on my community page if you wanted to have a voiceover tutorial video chit chat style or if you just wanted like a regular music style video and the majority of you guys really wanted a chit chat with me so that is what you're gonna get today i listen to you always remember that so as some of you guys already know i am at my family house out in the swedish archipelago it's super beautiful my grandfather actually built this house in the late 50s so my dad and his sister they pretty much grew up out here and it's so beautiful if you want to see more footage from our house and our little sw our swim time with martin because he loves to swim that's like his goal of life so then you can just go to my instagram and watch my story but Anyways, I've had some time to draw and paint, which I'm super happy about. It's been so many years since I just picked up a pen or anything and draw something. So uh, I'm just so happy that I got the time and the energy and the inspiration. So once again, if you want to see more of that, you can go to my Insta story. I'm planning on starting to do more video style with drawings and paintings such uh, because I know that you um, were asking for that as well. So anyways, for this video, I thought I'll do a 10 fun fact about me style thing. Um, so let's just get started. First one, my zodiac sign is cancer and I am a very family oriented type of person i don't have any brothers and sisters but uh we had a dog when i was uh, little he got to be 15 years old so he died when i was like 21 or something and he was like my little brother number two i was actually doing gymnastics as a kid and a teenager up till i was 15 years old and then I dislocated my kneecap. I had to go through surgery and I have a huge scar going straight across my left knee. So number three, I've actually been bitten by a tiger. It was a cub, but anyway, a tiger actually bit me right in the arm. I was only bruised, but Still, I've been bitten by a tiger. I can still say that. Yeah, that's the story behind that, but we'll talk about that some other time. Number four, I actually got back to nails uh, about five and a half, six years back because of my dad and I wanted, I wanted him to shut up because uh, I was actually, I just retired as a professional dancer and I had no income and my dad, he was like, well, you should just go and start doing nails again. And I hate it. I hate it doing nails because I hated the industry. Like where I had left off, it was, sh excuse my French, but shit. Yeah, you can actually thank my dad that I am here doing nails today because I, I got back into nails just because I wanted <laughs> to shut up. But anyways, number five, I have something called submechanophobia. Submechanophobia. I, I don't know really how to pronounce it, but I do have it. We're like a small percentage of the world that does have it. And it's the fear of man-made objects underwater. So like submarines, a bicycle, like way down underwater or something like that. I don't know why I have this, but I have the worst phobia of like submarines or anything. Like if I see something like in a movie and it's underwater, like the propeller. Okay, seriously, I, I even have a hard time talking about this. If I see like a, pro ah, a propeller like underwater, I panic. Ugh, okay, I need to stop talking about this. I have it. Number six. I actually got my creative side from my mom and my business side from my dad. Uh, because like 
seriously, everyone on my mom's side is like painting, singing, playing instruments, working with clay, and it's been like that, I guess, for centuries. And so I got that from my mom's side.、Uh, my my grandpa on my mom's side was actually an artist. Like he was working as an artist. And when I was a kid, I always said that when I grow up, I want to be an artist. I want to be a painter. And that's pretty funny that now I'm here painting nails. You know, it's kind of the same thing, but not really, but almost. Like my business side, I actually got that from my dad. He's been a suit, like typical suit businessman,、uh, traveling the world, especially the states. And it's so funny. I think I mentioned this in the previous video or somewhere.、Uh, I don't know, but I, I mentioned it that he was traveling and doing all this stuff that I'm doing now. But with like medical equipment,、uh, so he was traveling, yeah, back and forth to the states. All of his friends were Americans, and he was、uh, working at trade shows. He, I mean, it's it's so funny. Like we we seriously have the same life, but I'm you know working with nails, and he is not working anymore. But yeah, you know. And actually, I I have been teaching since I was 15, and the funny thing is that I. I'm convinced that I got that from my grandpa, from my my dad's side, because he was actually a teacher and a principal. Like I'm pretty sure that I got it from him. Number seven, my favorite food is drumroll pasta, and especially pasta bolognese. It's my favorite ever, or like anything with pasta. I can seriously eat pasta as it is. Number eight. I actually worked as a magician's assistant for about six to seven years.、Uh, there's a lot of videos on YouTube. I can link some videos in here if you want to. But yeah, I was I started when I was like 21. I think we went on until I was like 20, 27. So that yeah, that would be about six years. Yeah, so I've been cut in half. I've disappeared. I've done it all. I'll, I'll put some videos up here for you to check out if you want to. I have another really, really strange phobia. I have the worst phobia for wet paper. Like seriously, if any of you guys have the same phobia, just please let me know because this is so freaking weird. Like if Christian, my my boyfriend, if he throws like paper into the sink and it gets wet, I gag. Like seriously, I want to throw up. I can't touch it, and he knows that, so he has to pick it up. But that's like the worst thing ever. I hate it so freaking much. Number ten, last thing. I have a serious horror movie obsession. Like it's not even funny. I'm so freaking obsessed with horror movies. So here's a couple of my favorites. They're, they're, these are just a couple, but at least you know a couple. So we have The Shining, of course. The Triangle or Triangle. Paranormal Activity, like all them. At least the first three, four. Uh, Blair Witch, of course. Shutter Island, As Above, So Below. Oh, so good. The others and Devil's Pass. And I would say like anything with Tim Burton in it, even if it's not like horror, but just the、mm, feeling of it. Love Tim Burton, and especially if a movie has something with time travel in it.、Mm, love it. All right. So now I want to hear、uh, one fun fact about you. That would be awesome. Okay, so I'm just gonna give you a couple of upcoming things, so you know what's going on. I'm actually going to Philadelphia and Victoria, BC, in Canada, in September. I think Philadelphia, the Philadelphia class is like the 22nd. I think the Victoria classes are 26th and 27th. You don't want to miss that.、Uh, these are the last two classes that I will have in North America this year, so you should really check it out. I'm also going to be at the Stockholm trade show in September. I'm going to the Munich trade show. I'm going to Finland for a trade show. Light Elegance is doing like a tour, and it's going to be Oslo, Gothenburg, and Stockholm, I think. If you want to know more about my classes or anything, just sign up to my newsletter at selinabrighton.com. Not all these dates are official yet, so you should go to my website,、uh, sign up to the newsletter, and then you will have all the information that you need. Okay, so love <laughs> chatting with you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. If you want to see more videos like this, please hit a big thumbs up. 
And don't forget to subscribe, of course, and share. That helps me so much. Share this video with the people that you love. And also don't forget to check out my other social media like Instagram. And I will definitely see you on my Insta story very, very, very soon. All right. Take care. Love you guys so much. Mwah.